hiking on the beach right now it's low tide um, looks pretty eerie kind of foggy you can see as the banks just disappear in the background I'm standing where a, a pier used to be a long long time ago it's torn down and these are the uh, reminisce of what used to be an old pier a little bit of tide pulls out just real pretty so come along and walk with me all right come along come along Total fog. And then this way. More fog. It's kind of nice. I like it and stuff. The air smells really clean and fresh. Pretty, pretty nice waves and stuff, uh, glassy, not too big, kind of small. Just beautiful out, beautiful. All right, so um, a couple of people, some friends of mine asked me uh, why I started my YouTube channel. Like, what's the reason and stuff? And Maybe I think I'll share that with you, of why I started my YouTube channel. Um, essentially, back in, uh, let's see, uh, 1990, well, I want to say 2006 is where it kind of started for me. And uh, I had a situation, a life experience, you could say, um, that didn't work out. And caused me to have to rethink my life. Um, this life experience was pretty bad, you could say, and uh, I wasn't really, I was kind of caught a little bit off guard, too, and some people say when, when you uh, prep or you prepare or you think about things, um, mainly sometimes job loss is up on the highest, you know, things to prep for. This is above and beyond catastrophes that could happen. Um, wars, uh, earthquakes, things like that. A job loss is probably the first thing that can happen to most people. So I had a really bad um, situation and it caused me to get depressed and I was virtually living in my truck and um, I had life I had life real difficult for a couple of years maybe two years it was really really rough and I never really gave up I just tried harder and harder and harder and uh, I didn't think it would ever stop of the bad things kind of happening to me, one, one thing after another. Uh, and I slowly got my life back together. Um, I climbed out of my rut, if you might say. And it was very, very difficult to do this. Um, and it took a long time and a, long, a lot of effort, too, on my part. And, uh, a lot taught me a lot about life and to be forgiven and to forgive others and uh, I think that's why I started this uh, prepping channel stuff and, and outdoor camping whatever you might call it Renegade Outdoor Survival, Death Diver uh, the, the moral of the story is, is to 
prepare for things that could happen, including job loss or something minor like that and stuff. Because anything can happen to you. And my suggestion is to mainly be prepared. Uh, if I was prepared enough, um, I could have weathered the storm I had that I had to walk through to get where I'm at today. But um, I was a little unprepared, if you might say. But now, if any, if any bit of my inspiration helps others and helps, helps them out of a situation, there's plenty of people that do this online, on YouTube and everything, but I'm just hoping that uh, people can find uh, one or two things interesting and it might help them uh, so they don't ever have to go with, through what I went through, basically, through my difficult time. And I'll probably talk more about that, but I'm choosing to kind of stay off the negative stuff and everything. Um, but I get a lot of inspiration on these beach walks sometimes, and uh, it's, it's just really, I've, I've reached a moment in my life where things are really going good. And uh, it takes a long time to get there and stuff. Um, if you're young and you're starting out and you don't, maybe you want to get a couple items, I would suggest to do so. But um, take your time with the prepping and preparedness. It can be overwhelming. You know, there's a lot of stuff out there. And uh, people, everyone says I'm the best or I have this or I'm doing that. My suggestion is believe the guys, the average Joes, just like me, that, you know, they're like, I've tried this and it, and it works. Or I've gone to this area and I really enjoyed my vacation. We have nothing to lose, you know. And although we're small, in general, uh, our voices echo pretty far. I mean, I have some friends following my channel in Africa, Sweden, um, Denmark, and in Europe, and uh, even a couple friends in Japan and stuff. Um, but I hope with what I'm about ready to do with the channel, do, do a lot of fun things and have a lot of fun with uh, this particular channel and I hope it helps people. So that's why I started um, my channel and that's my story. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Let's continue our walk down the beach here. So I'm walking along the ocean right now and it's low tide. Uh, it's pretty nice out right now. Uh, come along. Let's have some fun.